In this video, we are going to see the syntax of create table in PostgreSQL and create table using PSQL shell. Create table using pgadmin4 then and properties of the table like like table owner name, number of the rows in the table. Now we are going to create table order info. See create table and name of the table. This is the column and this is data type name data type and this is a constraint not null which means it won't allow null values in these two columns. Here data type is numeric and this is the constraint which we are going to apply on the column name order info id. This is the order info id name. I will keep this SQL query in this video description. I am copying this one. Observe the output here. Create table which means table has been created successfully. To check whether it's created or not det and mention the table name. Here table name is order info. See table has been created successfully in the schema public. Here type is table. To get the one of the table name then execute the SQL statement select star from pg underscore tables where name equals to table name. Here table name is table name should be in either in single or double quotes. Put the colon at the end of the statement. See this is the schema name that is public. This is the table name. This is the owner name and we haven't we haven't mentioned any table space so it's a blank. These are the other properties of the table. To check the number of rows in the table select count star from order info. See count is 0 because it's a newly created table. I am going to check another table star from customer. See it contains 30 rows. This is how to check the owner name and how to check the number of the rows in a table. Let's create table using pgadmin4. See, I have opened pgadmin4. I have connected to the my PostgreSQL server 10 and these are the options available in. One is databases, another one logins or group roles and another one is table spaces. These are the two databases. I am going to create table in NYC PROD1 database. See, this is the plus symbol. Expand this one. To create table, we have to expand schema. See, we have only one schema. If you have multiple schemas then select the schemas from this schemas list. Now I am going to create table in this public schema. Right click on this one, select this create option then go to here table. Another way is expand again the schema that is public. Right click on this tables label and select create then select table. This is the window to create table. See notice here table name cannot be empty. We have to give the table name that is MP that is employees table. One of the table is first or if you want to give any customize it then select from this drop down. If you want to give another schema then here change it table space give the all the other options. Now give the columns names to create columns we have to create on this plus symbol. Give the name of the column name employee number data type is integer click on here and scroll down these are the data types available in postgresql server i want to give employee number as integer these are the integer ranges so i'm going with this integer next employee name is in characters so i'm selecting as var char type character varying which means var char length i'm giving max as 50 if you want to add more columns then click on this one and add like this don't add then remove this one. Okay. This constraint constraint step. We can apply five constraints like uh, foreign key, primary key, foreign key, check constraint, unique constraint, and exclude constraints. If you want to apply then click on this button and give the name and column names. 
so these are the free factors as void yeah etc if you want to mention partitions then give the range parameters security if you want to see the this is the sql command like how we did in psql shell so again i am going to general tab then click on this save button i am going to click on this save button. see here one table has been created expand this one see these are the columns constants indexes roles and triggers now if you want to see the properties right click on this table name and select properties see these are the properties you want to modify them then select this one and save this if you want to insert data right click on this one then select scripts then insert script see it opened ready made script in this script we have to replace question marks with respect to values of column 1 0 0 is my value and emp name is charge select this one select that this text and click on this execute button or press f5 i am going to click on this execute button see notice here it has taken 563 seconds if you want to get the rows of the table then you select star from emp select it and click on this execute button see it contains only one row if you want to get the number of rows in this ta in the table select count star from emp then select this text and and press the f5 see it contains only one row in this video we have discussed postgresql create table syntax then we have created table using psql utility or we can say psql shell then we have seen the then we have seen the table properties then we have created table using pg admin 4 in this video we have two different ways to create table in postgresql if this video is useful like it then subscribe for more updates thank you